You it is good you it's your boy Todd back here with another video and in this video today guys we're gonna be doing a gameplay of the new Bracket Busters free takeover reward Justin Jackson in NBA 2K23 my team if you are wondering how to get Justin Jackson well you just gotta go into a clutch time game online or offline I went to an offline game took me one game with Tracy McGrady knocked down 10 threes or 10 fours I should say and we've got the pink diamond Justin Jackson now he's no normal free takeover card this card 6'8 220 pounds 93 three ball 80 driving duck 88 ball handle good Block decent steel perimeter, solid enough into your 94 speed, 90 lateral quickness. Tendency wise for Justin Jackson, I wouldn't say it's great across the board with a five pass interception as well as on ball steel tendency. But he does have 11 on favors, agent three amp binders, catch and shoot dead eye, guard up limitless range, clamp breaker hyperdrive, quick first step as well. 38 gold badge, including handles for days, unpluckable anchor clamps, everything he needs. And that's the best part about this budget card is normally you'll get a budget card. They won't have unpluckable. They won't have limitless range. This Justin Jackson literally comes with everything. And when you look at Justin Jackson in shoot around, his player build looks absolutely massive, man. I mean, look at his arms. They just look huge, man. And you guys can say I'm sitting here gassing him. I don't care, man. His player build is really nice. How is his release? I mean, it's okay. I'm not going to sit here and say it's the best release. It really is like that Gerald Wallace type base, which, I mean, again, I don't think it's the best release I've ever used, but it is decently easy to time and easy to green. I mean, let's just put it on Hall of Fame for the sake of this video, right? In which it should be hard to green on Hall of Fame. Once you get the release timing down, you're going to be able to green with it. He also, again, comes with that Hall of Fame range, which I haven't really highlighted that much, but that is extremely important. The big deal for me and Justin Jackson is the fact that his player model is absolutely massive. I mean, it's massive. He's going to be able to guard some of the best guys in the entire game. It's that simple. I'm really liking what I'm seeing out of Justin Jackson. And I'm glad I got a Justin Jackson card that I can use and have fun with. Because when this card was at UNC... I really did like him, or when this guy was at UNC, I should say, not Carr, but I really did like him. And I know he's got a 35 standing dunk, but as long as you're over 6'5", that doesn't really matter too much. Justin Jackson is going to be extremely good and fun to use in my team. My opponent here is 101 in 28. This guy I'm playing is no joke. I mean, he's good at the game. He knows what he's doing. He's on leaderboards like, oh yeah, JJ? Ah, that's a good shot. 7%. I honestly could have greened it, probably. Y'all crazy. No way. I gotta say, if he hits that, that's just a crazy good shot, man. Credit to him. Yeah, JJ. Knock down. Knock down. He got Hall of Fame limitless range. If you think I'm gonna be scared to shoot that thing, you'd be wrong. I'm not scared. He got half range. What's there to be scared about? Ah, that's me. Get back. You gotta get there, TP. Good. Uh-oh. You're good. Yeah, JJ. JJ playing D right now. He playing D right now. Oh, yeah. TP snatch block. Run. Hit him. It's tough. That's a tough shot. It really is. Dot. Y'all good. Come here. Need it, JJ. I need it, JJ, and I got it. Nice shot there from Justin Jackson, and I needed that in a big way. That should be mine. Yes, good D, that's off board, that's brick board, hit him, hit JJ, standing dunk JJ, ah, that's not a standing dunk, but I'll take it, I knew he would jump, so I couldn't go up how I normally would, come here JJ, he got eight early points behind the back, hey, stiff arm man, he got half clamp breaker, standing dunk for Justin Jackson, I'm telling you, he might not be the best shooting guard in the game, but he can compete with everybody, I'm telling y'all that right now. Oh my. I got it. I swear I had him crab too. That's sad. Yeah, JJ. Straight to the cup, stiff arm. He got a standing dunk right there too. Now he got taken out taken out of it. But just the fact that he got a standing dunk animation right there is kind of crazy to me. Run. Run, Ben. Uh-oh.
Needed JJ. In a big way, I needed Perfect. JJ. That's a tough one. Coming off the screen, setting those feet, and getting those puppies in order. But it's not like he initially puts him on a pop. Like, he puts him on a roll and then adjusts it to a quick pop. Oh, my gosh. Rising up like that, jamming it down, JJ. Okay, I see you, man. He going toe-to-toe -to -toe with T-Mac. I love it. We are in and out dribble. Hey, JJ, stiff arm by him. Yo, what are you doing? Yo, JJ, what are we doing? I don't know. But you 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 scored a bucket somehow. Like I honestly don't know how it all worked, but you got me a bucket, so I can't even be mad. Look at JJ in the board. I'm telling you, his player model is something special. Hit him. Back to him. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yo, come on, JJ, you're hoping right now. Mine, mine, cookies. Yes. Where JJ hit him? For three? Justin Jackson is hoping right now. He hoping. Yeah, yeah, JJ. Yeah, JJ, yeah. Yeah, JJ, yeah, 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 yeah. We're going to get Mr. Justin Jackson a break here. But do y'all see the defense he's been playing? And I missed it. It's because he's a little tired. That's my fault, though. Thank you. Come again. Oh gosh. No, man. No. Bro, JJ's player build is just literally ridiculous. I mean, he gets how many stops just because of his player build? It's ridiculous, man. His player build makes up for so much. Like, he doesn't even have any hop defensive badges. It's just his player build that is just so ridiculous. Set a good screen. Oh, yeah, straight to the cup. I huh, guess, bro. Thank Look you. Come again. Look at him, man. Hey, yeah. Please, D-Rob. I need one finally, man. Like, finally I needed a bucket, and you gave me one. About time, D-Rob, man. I am so tired of these fake Andes, bro. Like, I am so tired of it. Look at what my JJ doing, though. Another standing dunk. We got to get him a break. We're up a ton. So, for Justin Jackson at this stage, there's no pressure. Green. There's literally no pressure to be great. He's now fresh, and he's got his break, and so he should be absolutely outstanding. Now, again, he got a little tired in that first half, and it showed, but defensively, that's where I've been impressed. And it honestly surprises me that defensively he is this good. Why? Okay, I could have definitely greened that. It doesn't matter. Dot. It's a dot. It's a big yeah. That's a dot. Oh my gosh, JJ, stiff arm. Bro, D-Rob, get out of JJ's paint, man. JJ about to get 30, man. Get out of his paint. Look at, the, look at the player model. Hit him. I don't care. Could have taken it in for a dunk, but I like the pull-up J for Justin Jackson Jr. I said Justin Jackson Jr. Bro, what am I saying right now? It's too early in the morning. It's way too early in the morning, man, to be doing a gameplay with Justin Jackson, and I'm thinking about Jaron Jackson Jr. Great. You can't guard him. Like, he is giving this T-Mac buckets on every possession right now. Oh my. I ain't do I did all that and didn't convert on it. That's sad. That's a bucket though. That's a bucket. You can't just switch screens on D Rob. It's just not gonna work. 
The only question left to solve in this game is, is Justin Jackson going to get 40? What is going on? He can't guard JJ right now. It don't matter what move I be doing. Look at the D he playing. No walk packs. Uh-uh. Stay right here. Yeah, JJ got him on locks. JJ got him on a, in lockdown right now. Yeah. Yeah, JJ. This game is sorry, board. This game is so sorry. <laughs> Look at him. Come on, man. That's my fault. I apologize. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. He tired. He is exhausted. Stop throwing it out to the perimeter when JJ is lurking. Finish him. Let's go home. Let's go home. There won't be a bigger stand than me for Justin Jackson. This card is absolutely elite. He's better than Jetty Osmond because he plays better defense. And it all has to do with his player model and player build. He's 6'8", but his player model is massive. This card is elite. And definitely the card you should choose today. You guys need to get him. Grind out the challenge. It takes you 10 minutes to do max. And use Justin Jackson. And see how much you like him. If he makes your squad, cool. If he doesn't, okay. Like, it doesn't really matter at that point. But the card is elite in my team, and nobody can tell me any different. You can play him at small forward. He's just fine. His release isn't necessarily great, but everything else about the card is outstanding. Not going to say he's a must-get, but you should grind him today and just see what happens. That's going to wrap it up for our video today, guys. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love you guys. Have a blessed day.